love and live show okay i'm gonna do a quick eggnog recipe so you can make eggnog for your family for the christmas for the holidays or any time of the year it's up to you so first i have my five eggs there you go got your whipping cream your scent of love condensed milk and milk and we're going to use two two of those that's just one right now so those are all the ingredients the first thing we want to do is pour our eggs i did this pot because i can use um this on it without scraping the teflon five large egg yolks okay if you have a uh, small then do probably like six or seven just to give that extra in there okay oh and then we got sugar i forgot to show you all the sugar but it'll be one cup of sugar. I'm using a half a cup, so that's one, and then we'll do another, and that's one cup. So you stir the sugar and the egg together, and they'll come into like a regular hardcore paste. And you'll be like, what the heck is going on? Why am I doing this? And that's kind of what it looks like, like that. Okay. So you're going to stir it until it gets um, liquefied. Try to show y'all every chance I can. So, getting liquefied there. This has consistency, kind of wood. You could do it a little longer if you want to. But it's got the more liquefied. It done filmed up a little. So we're gonna actually go a little bit longer just to get it to its full potential. Now we're gonna add our cup of milk. So this is one. Oops, this is two. Okay, so then you mix it up with the milk until it's all combined. So get it all in there. And mix it up with the milk. Now, a lot of people will cook the milk, put their cinnamon and all that, and cook the milk and leave the eggs to the side. I'm all about quick and easy. And when I learned about this, when I was making some lemon curd, I said I should put this with my egg. Out. So that's what it's gonna look like. My Cine Love has a lot of ingredients in it. But it does have clove, milk, and egg, and cinnamon, of course. So I'll just sprinkle a couple of drops in there. I'll show you how much I sprinkle. Don't put too much of mine in there. But you can use a cinnamon leaf or vanilla if you want. That's how much. And if you mix it in, on a nice break. And then what I'm going to do, I'm going to show it to you after I mix it in. And we're just going to cook it and keep um, mix it. So that's what it looks like. Almost like a French toast batter. Just keep stirring, just keep stirring, just keep stirring. They'll have a little foam because it's starting to consistently. Don't worry about that, that, that way. Let me show you what I'm talking about. It's starting to loose. And a little foam on there, don't worry about that. And that way, they just keep stirring. Now I can smell the aroma. I can tell it's cooking up because I can now smell the cinnamon. And all the other flavors of warm and not in it. It's not going to go through the house here until it's just a little bit hotter. So because I'm over the stove now, I can smell it. It's just really bad. No, fun fact is, eggnog, back in the day, I don't know if it is, it was made with, of course, the raw eggs and nobody cooked it. So, yeah. So these are the ones that I see, and they have like a lemon juice in there, so they actually cook it, you know. Yeah. What is going on?
I don't know, will some of y'all like warm it now? Like that's something that warm it now? I like some both. And then this is where you can actually be sitting while you're stirring for a long time. You can sit here and think about what I'm probably going to put in there because you can grab it in half and spice cream in it. One time I put um, Kahlua and uh, Bailey's in it. That was really good. You can do all kinds of stuff. You can make a cocoa egg now. Put some cocoa powder in there. And it's just getting hotter and hotter. And hotter. You just want to make sure that your eggs are cooked. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. We're going to go ahead and put the condensed milk in. Judge you if you like your cheap or like judge if you like your big brand. This is your egg now. You took it, they gotta enjoy what you do. Mm -hmm. Make sure you like it. If you want to have a good and clean, you know, and it skips to the bottom, goes to the top. And then in a few, get your taste of spoon. Make sure that it is not too sweet. Now you can do a cup of liquor in it. I do a, um, I'm smart this time because I had Chris, he had a one and a half cups, so he was the only one to drink. I think he did that on purpose. Thought he's a half a cup. Taste now. I don't know if it's good. Let me see. It might not be that good of a anyway. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah. We've got a little bit more uh, whipping cream in it because mine's a little too sweet. you want. Okay, y'all. Um, so, I checked it before and it was still way too sweet, so I just added two things of milk. But this is the consistency you want, where you pour it off and it still stays on your spoon. And you know it's thick. And now, you know, it's thick. And then we can go ahead and taste it. Mm. Yeah, so, all the okay, baby. This batch I use four cups of regular milk, two and a half cups of condensed, I mean two half cups of whipping cream. So we're gonna pour it. So okay, so you hear the water running in my pot, but this is what it looks like. And now we're gonna stick it in the refrigerator. Put the lid on it. Put the lid on it. And when we come back, we're gonna taste this. And if you want to, this will be the time for you to add your alcohol in it. And you go in the refrigerator so it can set longer in it. So I hit this to my water. Mm -hmm. It'll be good. So you can. We'll all try the eggnog. And you'll get the honest review. Uh, this Hello, we're back. Okay, so it's been a day. And so now... We're going to have Eliah try the eggnog. So here we go. We're going to show you Eliah. We got it decorated. Very pretty eggnog with the cinnamon, cinnamon love on it with some whipped cream. Let's see if I did good. Mm. Oh, this is really good. Homemade is the best, I'm telling you. 
I didn't think it was going to taste like this. This is really good, actually. <laughs> so you need to tell people that they need to make their yeah, own? Yeah, make this recipe now, immediately. <laughs> and you might need her son of love to get it to taste like this, but get this. Uh, you've seen how to make it. Make this now. Mm-hmm. There you go. This is actually really good. I'm glad you enjoy it. <laughs> okay. <laughs> and then this is mine and the little one right here. Got the center level on it. Mm-hmm. Telling you guys, homemade eggnog is the best. Go and make you some. And remember to love and live each day as if it were lives. your what? Your last. And then you gotta say Treat smooch. Treat like this last cup of eggnog. <laughs> smooch and bye. Love, love, live, live, eat, eat, day, day, as, as, if, if, was, was, your, your, last.